Alright people, welcome back. Part 2 of the telethon. So, so far, no suggestions for the deck. Everybody sees it seems like the, the deck is fine. Something in hand is not terrible. You know, it's, it's actually doable. Summon the Deneb, search for the Altair. I have the back row to play. So, so we're going to get some Blue Eyes deck. So, uh, I saw some suggestions. Uh, one suggestion was to uh, play play matches, but... You know, it's hard enough to go ahead and get someone to play on TCG rules, because most of the time people don't even want to play on TCG rules, let alone uh, play match. So I tried hosting for a match. Absolutely no one wanted to show up. They're like, nah, I, I don't want to do a match. Like, oh, okay, fine, don't. No. So I couldn't get that. I couldn't get that. Uh, the next suggestion was to do a live stream and do subscribers. That sounds like a great idea, except for the fact that I don't have much time left. Like, this is going up Thursday. I am leaving like Thursday night, and then you're gonna get one more video on Friday because I record a day ahead. By the time you see part three on Friday, I'm already gone. I'm, I'm probably by the time you see it on Friday, I'm probably already in Utah. So, uh, I don't really have time for a live stream. I apologize, definitely. No, that's fun. You gonna get greedy? Well, you could turn her to defense, but, but I guess if I attack her, then she'd turn to attack, right? So, let's go ahead and play Mirror Force on your ass. Mirror Force, it does not target, so... No, Maiden. Bad Maiden. Bitch! Took y'all out. Just gonna sit here and poke you. <laughs> I don't really need the Upstart Goblin right now. I'll hold on to it. It's just starts hitting the fan, which I doubt at this point. Because I, you know, I have the Trevor ready or the Delta Rose, if he just chained the Nova, if he tries to do any cute plays. Oh, oh, I'm sitting, I'm sitting, I'm sitting pretty chill right now. You know, do I want you to kill my Deneb? Yes, of course. Do I want you to keep that Maiden on the field? No, that's why I'm here for us. Yeah, I had to weigh the good with the bad. I had to, had to be like, yeah, which one, which one? <laughs> Ah, that's fine. You want to use your Silver's Cry on Alexandrite Dragon? Go right ahead, I don't care. You want to summon it and kill my... I said, the Mirror Force is more for your Maiden. I, I could take out the Alexandrite Dragon by myself. You can't have that, don't I'm mad at. So you're going to go ahead and kill my Deneb? That is fun. Also, that... That duel against the hero player in part one. I lost I lost that, that was my fault. I, I couldn't know that the um the the mass change. And I totally forgot you could summon monsters in defense. Like I don't know why I thought you know, monsters don't get summoned in defense often, so I have no idea why I thought you oh you can't summon monsters in defense. That's crazy. Yeah, you can, so oops. <laughs> That's all I have to say about that. Oops. No, I'm the nab. Let's say I got the Nova right here. If you want, to, if you want a beef, you want beef, homie. All right, you have Vega. See, and this is why I like running two Vega. Three is cloggy. Two, one is not enough. I'll go ahead and go to Deltros. Yeah, Deltros. I'm also thinking about maybe raising Trevor up to three, but I'm not sure about that either. If I trigger you three times and I haven't won the duel, then that's totally my bad. Yeah, that card. What is it? Hmm. And you didn't want to play it last turn? I know you had it. Well, then, Catastrophe, you could have played it last turn. Hmm. I'm not going to tell you how to play Yu Gi Oh! But yeah, you could have played it last turn, sir. I don't have much Telluride monsters in my deck anymore, though. I think all I have is, what, one more... One more Altair? It's not terrible. Not terrible. That's another thing that I'm liking Trib more, is that I can summon from the graveyard. And by that time, I probably have some Tell Knights in the grave to take advantage of. I'm gonna pop that new one. It needs Upstart attack. I could see two turns into the future, but right now, I really don't need it. I'll just hold on to them for extra draws. No. I'm already winning up an advantage, and I don't nearly need to push for anything, so I'm just going to take the duel slow. I'm just sniping out them cards. I'm like, no, get rid of that D-Prison. No, get rid of that Mobile Catastrophe. 
no, no, no. Not that he knows I have a Nova, but you know, if, if, you're, if you're just gonna keep on setting uh, cards, you know, this card has infected me in this dual gap, so I'm not worried about this. But every time you set a new card, and you think, you know, especially when you set play no monsters, it's obvious that it's gonna be something to try to take out my Delta Rust. Oh, you're gonna take 25 monsters chin, so I might as well just use Delta Rust back and pop the new card. Wow. Well, I guess that's game then. Unless you have like a Gorse or something. You know let's just go ahead and find out what this card was. Is it like a bottomless trap hole that you can play? No, you could have played it. I have no idea what this could have been. Let's find out. It's MST this entire time. Nah, that's fine. I win anyway, so. It was it MST people? Did anybody guess MST? Anybody? No? That he held on to it for so long? See, I knew it. I knew that card wasn't anything to phase me. Okay, I think it's frozen. I mean, I won anyway, just attack, attack, but I think it froze, because I can't do anything. I think he surrendered and the death pro froze, so. Alright, let's get another duel in. Be right back. Alright, let's get another duel in. I will go ahead and go first. Huh. So that's not terrible, but it's not the best. You know, I didn't open up with the... With the... Sovereign. That's the, that's the problem with this two-card combo. Combos, I, I can go ahead and search for one. But unless I already have one, it doesn't start up, you know? So I'll take dual slow. There's really no point in overextending and revealing my deck so far. Dark Greffer. Okay. Some kind of zombie synchro deck. Malicious Plague. I don't think it should be a Ubel deck. I mean, if it is, then... Ooh, I'm sorry. Nah, that's fine. So, you're gonna use Dark Greffer effect? No. I mean, he's gonna come after me. Fine. Go ahead, sir. You really thought you were gonna use Dark Greffer effect. What's the point of, you know, Rota searching and summoning him if you're not going to use his effect? You could have just, you know, used Ar Armageddon Knight. Eh, <sighs> whatever. I'm not going to tell you how to play you, girl. And, you know, I'd rather you use Armageddon Knight. Hmm. Okay. Oh, that's fine. It's totally fine. Take it. I'll take it all. It's fine. Yeah. And of course, you couldn't use Dark Graffer then because, you know, she would get sent for the cost, so you wouldn't get her effect. You get whoever you send for the deck to the graveyard, but not her in particular. Okay. Well, I'm going to start going on the offensive now. One of those things Scepter can do is, uh, Search for a chair, which has a 2,000 booty, so. so. Could I stall out till I get something? Yes. Do I want to? Not really. <laughs> Is my effect okay? Uh, of course, this card says normal summon. Special summon. Fuck. If only it was flip summon too. It's just summon period. That would awesome. I probably could have done that awesome combo with Book of Moon. Uh, oh no. Oh well. Alright. Let me go ahead and bait out any back row that I see. Huh. Okay, that's fine. That's what you want me to do. Fine. I'm still trying to keep my life points over 2,000 so I can at least still play this long morning. So, of course, Dark Reffer can't attack me directly anymore. Oh, 
Oh my god, if I draw another scepter. That's really what I want right now. Either a scepter or a Deneb. If I can get into this duel. I hate getting multiple Altairs, because Altair can't do anything with himself. It's been happening a lot lately on fucking Dub Pro here. Are you going to attack with Eris? What's up? Pokemon and kill my scepter, now what? Look at this. This number generator has blessed me with a lot of cards at one, but I don't need cards at one. Shit. Shit, I'll take a Vega, I'll take a Deneb, uh, I'll take another Scepter. There's, there's, a lot, there's a lot of cards that I totally don't mind getting, so. Honest is not one of them. Honestly, I, 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 honestly, I don't need Honest. Sit on the Sovereign. If he's gonna get over my Sovereign, he's gonna have to overextend a little bit more than just those two. So that's what I want to pull out of him. Just stall the fuck out. And Honest is nice and all, but it's not going to get me out of this situation right now. There's the nab. There is Mr. Daneb. Uh, give me a Vega. I got the Altairs. See? I stalled out. So go ahead and kill her. Go ahead and get your effect, I don't care. Oh, it's Infernities. Didn't even know. Didn't even know. Go ahead. Infernities. You have way too many cards in your hand now, sir. Get another Dark Reffer. Okay. 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 So you're gonna exceed those two? Because I know you still can't get over my Sovereign Teeth. That's the thing. I'm gonna pull more out of you. Yep. There you go. You are saying. It's a fucking utopia, hello? Is there a solid warning? Is it? Oh, you're just gonna lose connection and quit. Okay. Like I said, you were winning, like point wise. I was thinking about whether that's worth some warning or just a bottomless hit. I don't know. But that's exactly what I wanted you to do overextend. Alright, we'll get another duel in. Be right back. <clears throat> Alright, let's get another duel in. Hopefully, open up better. I don't like having to stall the fuck out. Ah, this hand is fine. I'm gonna go this route first. Yeah. Decked in a little bit, and if I get a if I get a scepter, then hey, you know, let's go. But I'm gonna set that up, start debate, they must take. Can use it next turn. I want him to just go MST, the Nova, you know. If he has the MST, if he has two MSTs, and you know, or if he hits the Alpha first, then it's fine, whatever. But you know, I'm gonna do a little more than that. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Thanks. Ah, be right back. All right. Hopefully, my opponent just won't outright quit. Seems like we've been getting a lot of quitters lately. Let's see how we open. Ah, oh, we opened up fine. Again, once again, we got the neb. Yeah, go ahead and search me for Altair. I'll set the upstart goblin again. If I need to use it, I can always flip it up, so. Stand set. Ah, oh, my opponent doesn't have an extra deck. Alright, well. I guess I'm assuming I'm going against something scrubby, so. Or please. Nope, something scrubby. Alright. I should have known with that. I don't know why I didn't know with that. 
Fuck it, I'll take the duel slow. Might even castell that. Yes. Go ahead and search me for Vega. Really don't feel like giving him life points right now. Yeah, I'm gonna castell it. That I feel I feel something snacky in my bones, so I shouldn't give him any more time than necessary. He just push for as much damage as possible. If he wants to start using his battle faders and Swiss scarecrows, I'd rather him use them now than wait three turns, then start using them. You know what I mean? You don't know what I mean. You know. Then if he wants to try that shit again and play another sword, so I can just dealt I can just dealt Russell next turn. And pop the swords. Like you're not getting fucking swords. Stop being fucking sacky. You're not gonna do this shit. Either you're gonna battle me or I'm gonna beat the living shit out of you. I go. Yes. Altair. Yes. Good enough. Yes. You two shut up. Shit. I mean, Altair. Go into a Deltaros. Yeah, I'm liking two Vega. Two Vega's working. She's torquing it up. Pop. Like, please stop with the goddamn Swords of Revealing Light. That's, that's, that's my problem with Swords of Revealing Light. Whenever my opponent gets one, they always have multiple. Always. No point in setting the Mirror Force. So play Swords of Revealing Light again. Go ahead, motherfucker. I dare you. I triple dare you. Thank you. Just quit, you fucking scrub. Sword of Being Light? Oh, I lost it. Sword of Being Light? Oh, okay, I quit. Uh, you won't let me start until I get Exodia, I quit. Fucking scrubs. We're back. Alright. This one was quick. This person got in here quick. Deceived. Yeah. And it's not that good. Oh, he allowed me to go first. Oh. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. This hand is probably the worst hand I've gotten so far. Just, uh, just take some damage to the chin. This is the worst hand I've gotten so far with this deck. And I'm going against spell books. Ah, oh, this sucks. Wow, Breaker Two. I'm gonna get the shit beat out of me. I can only take so many 19s. Come on, let me just get in this duel. Let me get a Denab. Let me get in, uh, something. Not Altair. Definitely not Altair. I'll play it, though. And the reason why I'm going to play it is because I have lots of Revival and I have the Nova. So, if he does anything, I can go ahead and just Nova it and, uh, draw a card. Because hopefully drawing a card will allow me to stay in this duel. Because holy shit. Yes, Rota. Whoo! Okay, back in this duel. Andrew is fine. Who the fuck is that? Are you gonna summon her? Oh, okay. Sure. Let's card it to some select and replace of cards and See I don't want to allow you to do that because I have vanities. You're gonna summon him back. He only doesn't dumb summon, you're gonna exceed into something. I don't know what you're planning. I'll let it go though. I don't know what you're planning. You're up on resources, so I don't have to worry about an exiton. I have no idea what you're planning. Lava chain, that's what I was thinking. Like, you're gonna go into lava chain and I guess get yourself set up.
So you're gonna try to digin lock me? You're gonna go ahead and send Jin and then try to ritual summon and pants to Jin. Is that what you're gonna do? Oh, you want on top of the deck. You don't want it in your on the graveyard. You want on top of the deck. Okay, I guess. All right, got the chair. Activate Rota. Go ahead and search me. Or the nub. The nub. Yes. Go ahead and get me. Vega. No. Yeah. Vega. I already have the call hunts and shit, so I'm totally fine. Is anybody I, I need to I need to kill the wild chain. That's obvious. But is there anybody I can actually go into to handle this situation? Uh who's particularly strong. Uh, the strongest person I got is Castell. I can Exiton, but I'd rather hold on to that, especially since I got two Castells. I wish it was Vega in the graveyard and not <laughs> Altair, but it's fine. I'm planning on triggering in upcoming in the duel anyway, so. Alright. No, I didn't. Uh, let's say. Wait, I didn't use. His effect, so I, I can't attack. Like, oh, wait, I can't attack. Like, yeah, wait, I can't attack. I didn't use Altair effect. Yeah, and I, get it. I gotta get that off the field. Alright, and then as soon as you try to summon that bitch, I'm gonna fucking flip up vanities. Because you're gonna, obviously, you're gonna tribute that fucking releaser and try to lock me out of the duel. So, how about I just lock you out of the duel with the nice vanity to emptiness? How's that sound? That doesn't sound like a fucking plan. You're the one who's trying to be the douche, so how about I be to be the douche first? I'm gonna activate my douche mode before you activate your douche mode. It's fine. Pay cost. Yeah, just shut up. No special summon. Mirror Force, so that will get me out of the Dune Lock. Oh, no, wait, if he summons that bitch, she can't be destroyed by Carfax as long as she hits face up on the field. Is that Ven? This is a staple now, so I'll just go ahead and chill with it. Say, so can you get over 2,000 beaters without special summoning? Probably not. <sighs> wow, and I'm all set up, too. I said, I'm just worried about the releaser. The releaser can easily lock me out of this and duel, especially since she can't be destroyed by card effects. That will fucking hurt, because that's usually how you get around the Jijin lock, is you destroy the monster by card effect. You, know, you use the mirror forces, the mergekis, and stuff like that, so I pretty much need to draw into Book of Moon. And she summons that bitch, and targets face-up cards. You know. But she finds a way to sum summon... She'll have this call the haunted. Is that it? Yeah, set a monster. That's fine. I said I'm gonna beat you to death. I am not in a hurry. Put it back. Just put it back. I don't need you to have releaser. You did all that with low wall chain to get releaser. Like, no, thank you. So it's gonna be kind of hard for you to get over a 2,000 meter without special summoning, let alone your booty. Uh, that's what that's what you had with your booty, unless you have like another another releaser. Wow, I'm so fucking set up, like so fucking set up. How strong was that bitch? She was like 27, wasn't she? Can you like show me to her? 27, yeah. Start pushing for more damage. What's this do? Unaffected by trap cards. Okay, that's fine. It's just the releaser. Like, that's the only one I care about is the releaser. Wow. 
Okay. You wanna crash the throttle tire? Sure, go ahead. It's fun. No, it's fine. Just the releaser that I care about. So you're gonna pitch her to summon her. Okay. That's fine. You can't be destroyed by Cartifact? Like, I can't handle that. Shit. I could just fucking triv. Triv, put everything back, and pack for game. That's game. I won. So I don't give no fucks. The only one I gave a fuck about was Releaser. You take the you take the ritual mechanic and you make it fucking from a decent mechanic to a fucking lockdown gay ass fucking shit with one goddamn card with Releaser. If Releaser was banned, I wouldn't give two fucks about the ritual mechanic. You know? You know? Necros would just be a good deck to duel against. It wouldn't be fucking just straight up just retarded like it is now. Alright, let's deck them, deck them a bit. Now since you finally got rid of my uh, vanities, I can actually start pushing for shit. I don't care. I don't care. You can get all the fucking counties in the world. I'm gonna trove your ass anyway, so it doesn't even matter. Yeah, actually give me this. You can gain all the counters in the world. I do not care. I shouldn't have played that upstart though. Whatever. Yeah, I should have played the upstart because I gave you more life points. Which is not something I want to do. Alright, so I'm gonna go. Should I go this out? Do I have any all tires left? No, I don't. I don't really. I don't have anybody left. Nope, I have, I have all my Telenites. Alright. Well, then I guess I'm just gonna go ahead and go Vega Altair, summon Deneb, and go for Triv. Anything I wanna call the Haunted? Actually, I can go call the Haunted, call the Haunted, summon. this wasn't on the field, I could go for my super chocolate fudge covered uh, Rape Unite, but no, it's better to go ahead and go into uh, go into Triv right now. Yeah, I shouldn't have gave you them thousand points. I got greedy, I really wanted to get Scepter. Uh, I have Telenites left? Maybe like a Vega? Yeah, I got one Vega. Alright. It's like, wait, I have Telenites left? Now I have all the Telenites. Alright. Trev. Everything back. Give me that. And you have a thousand life points left, because I gave you a thousand. I allowed you to live. That's the funny thing. I allowed you to live. <clears throat> uh, I know you got the Endymion, and that's uh, there's two cards I don't know you have. You got a Breaker. That's fine. You can go Breaker Break. I don't. I don't care. I don't care. That's fine. I don't need to call the haunted. That's fine. Oh, that's game. I'm just fucking regeki your ass. Me. Oh, another ritual. Alright. So regeki your ass. And poke you for game. And that will be it for part two. So just ton of butt kicking. Starting to get used to that. Starting to get used to it. Alright, so I'm gonna call that for part two. Uh, part 3 you'll be getting up tomorrow, but like I said, by that time you see Part 3, I'll probably already be in Utah. So, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of uh, the Telethon. So thanks for watching, thanks for all the support. Like I said, if you have any suggestions, <coughs> uh, go ahead. The deck profile still hasn't changed uh, since uh, the one I did in Daily Duels. So if you want to see the deck profile, link is in the description. The end of the uh, episode of Daily Duels. And uh, yeah, so like I said, if you have any suggestions for the deck, be sure to say it in the comment section below. So thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow.